Hey guys, Riskate here, and welcome back to Sherlock Holmes Chapter 1. Um, so last I left off, we tried to do a bandit layer, and I died and got pissed off, so... <laughs> we're just gonna, we're, we're gonna chill on that for now, and we're gonna head to Silverton. Um, he can be find, found on the north side of the Finch Cannery in Silverton. So we'll see. We'll see. Excuse me, everybody. Ah, but how are you guys? How's life? How are things? I'm doing okay. I am doing okay. I'm doing better than I was, so I'm thankful for that. I'm ready for this fucking year to be over, though. By the time this comes out, it is, so happy uh, 2024. I am. I don't have high hopes for this year. I'm keeping it low so that hopefully I won't be disappointed. What is this? Oh. Fuck Bernadotte. Cheap antique trader. Well, how about that? Okay. So warehouse number one, warehouse number two, warehouse number three. Okay. So, where's the Finch cannery? That's what I need to know. Ah! So he's on the northern side of it. Gotcha. Um, do they give any details? They don't... Yeah, they didn't give any details about who might be the right one to talk to. Wait, is it you? Ah, found you. Is this familiar to you? Yes, friend. I know something about this business. The cannery is located on Tand Road in Silverton. Okay. I mean, yeah, we found the cannery. I mean, did we not? <laughs> I... Because, I mean, that... Oh, shoot. Jesus, my bad. Um, I mean, yeah, we found, we found it. Oh. On Tanned Road. I, did I say tannery? I don't know what I'm saying. I'm a little high. Okay, so this, is this it? I mean, this is Tanned Road. These guys don't like me, so I probably shouldn't talk to them. Friendly, it's a Greek robber. That's not the northern side of anything, though. Be all right. Um. I mean that that robber might know some things. He's really the only person I'm seeing that would probably know something. I mean, this isn't the northern side either. I mean, smugglers and robbers aren't really the same thing. Just throwing that out there. Do you know anything? Okay, you're hostile. Let me leave you alone then. Can I go in? No? I just, I thought that that one guy was the guy I needed to talk to. Oh, this took me all the way back. Wait. It's implying like there is a way I can go in, though. Do you know anything? Despising. 
Gotcha. Noted. What about you? Okay, they... None of them like me here. Okay, maybe I should go back and talk to that... That robber. Unfriendly. Gotcha. Say no more. See, I mean, it's... It's implying that I can go in. I don't know. I don't know, ma'am. This is a little confusing. But at least it's just a side mission, so... If I don't do it, I'm not, like, that concerned, but it's like, I want to try and do as much as I can. But I probably won't do everything, everything. Because who has the time? Can I go in this way? Okay. This has to be who I need to talk to. It's gotta be. Ah, there we go. I can't seem to find the boss. Where's Penza? I'm not your nanny, you daft muck snipe. I need to get more men to warehouse too now, so quit bothering me, will you? Noted. Warehouse 2 it is. Warehouse number two is located on Evernote Street. Top House Top Hat Jones mentioned that he needs to get more men to warehouse two. Okay. So we need to go to warehouse three. Or near warehouse three. The informal will respond to the code phrase, how much for the fish? Okay. Gotcha. Where's warehouse three? Okay, so he's found somewhere near here. Gotcha. I wonder if I should still be dressed up like this. I don't know. I'm gonna save just in case. Just in case. Um, let's do a fresh new one. Okay. So this is warehouse three. My cross informer should be somewhere around here. Try not to mess it up, or you'll blow his cover. Okay. Um, hold on. He's an ex-military who lost his eye in battle. Shouldn't be too difficult to find him, then. Ah. Glass eye. I think we found him. How much for the fish? Do you know anything about this? Hey, you're a lucky man. I know about this. The informant was unable to reveal Panzer's location to me, though he did tell me that the eels reduced the number of guards at Warehouse 3. Uh, it could have been more helpful, but all right. All right, nice. I, I'm always so proud when we when we sniff out, or we, when we complete John's missions. Okay, so I think we need to go to two. I think. So I mean, he was saying that that's where he needed to go. That he needed to get more men to warehouse two. That's what I assume. And since they're lowering security around here, this one's probably not it. So okay. Let's go to warehouse two. So we'll 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 go right, then left, then we should be there. <laughs> we'll save before we go inside just in case it's wrong. Swing to the left, swing to the right. Strand on stage, center of the lights. This looks like warehouse two to me. Where's the door to this bitch? I mean, is, is it not? I'm sorry. I didn't really mean to bump into him, but Sherlock is just so aggressive sometimes. Right? Oh, okay. It's probably up here. What? Leave me alone. Okay, yeah, we're gonna save just in case. Just in case things go tits up. Okay. <clears throat> Sup. Swan. 
Oh, I think we were right. I think we might have been right. Oh boy. Who the hell is that? Get him. Fuck you. I don't have time. Take a rest, my friend. Get away from me, you fucking weirdo. Hold on. Hey. Hey, why didn't it? Hold on. What the fuck? Hold on, let me take care of your stupid little hat. I'm coming for you. Yeah, uh huh? There you are. Too simple. The snuff's ready. You keep telling yourself that. That's probably too far away. It's like... You're not near anything else that'll... Stop you in your tracks. So, gotta use the snuff on you. No more crime for you until next month. Shit, where? Oh. Really? Sweet, that did work. I thought he was too far away from it. Don't cry. Give him the pepper snuff. Okay. Will do. Would you just fucking leave me alone, please? God, y'all are like fucking roaches. The snuff's ready. Damn it. Oh my god. Y'all are so annoying. He's all yours now. Watch this. Jesus. Don't cry. Give him the pepper snuff. Would you shush, John? Just need to fucking reload. There we go. Damn it. Damn it! God bless! Too simple. The snuff's ready. Cool. Oh, my. oh, oh. Oh, y'all are. Y'all are really trying me. Oh, nice time to reload, Sherlock. Why? Why is everybody so bad at reloading? <laughs> In games I play. Time to knock. Okay, sure. Damn it. Well, that was a waste. There we go. That works for me. Don't give him the pepper snuff. Oh my god, John. Please stop narrating. As much as I love you, please stop narrating. I couldn't miss the party. Okay. Don't cry, you'll live. The snuff's ready. You're annoying. I really hate the guys with like the weak spots on their back. I hate that in all gaming though. Take a rest, my friend. Are we done? Sweet. Hallelujah. That's always my question with these combat sections. Are we done? New entry, John's Diary. I must say, this was quite the impressive encounter. I think Sherry invented a couple of new tricks. Oh! What the- I thought we were done! What the fucking hell? I thought that was it! Oh my god! It's all yours now. Go for it. Are you joking me? Don't bother moving. You've okay. lost. Now are we done? Good god. I captured Panzer. Oh, okay. That makes sense now. Never mind. Now I should report back to Yasmin at the newspaper. <sighs> Panzer is captured, but alive. Now to report to Miss Sertle. She's gonna be so proud, she's gonna shit herself. Hopefully she'll stop with the weird, creepy advances. Okay, and she was at uh, the Chronicle, right? I think. 
pretty sure. Pretty sure she was at the Chronicle. We're gonna say she was. I guess we'll find out. Okay. Lady, guess what? Good news. I deduced the location of Friedrich Panzer and was able to apprehend him. So I heard. What a coup. Congratulations are in order. And a new article in the paper. Perhaps a sterling stranger squashes smugglers? How kind of you. I'm sure, with little more thought, you will land on the perfect headline. Huh? Uh, with a little more thought, uh, you're no writer, Mr. Holmes. Leave it to someone who knows what sells. Since you're here, Mr. Holmes, how about an interview? Uh, strictly on background? Get to know the real you. Mycroft is rather tight-lipped, as you know. Information is Mycroft's currency, and he does not disperse it lightly. He will tell you a barefaced lie without hesitation if it advances his cause. As for your request, I'm afraid the real me pales in comparison to your vivid imagination. An interview would do us both a disservice. Hmm, perhaps it's best to let the mystery be. Uh, now, on to other matters. We have another case for you. Are you interested? I'd never hear the end of it from Mycroft if I declined, so please, Miss Sirtle, fill me in. I cannot. Your brother insisted that the contents of this envelope were for your eyes only. I can merely wish you a clear mind and a fleet foot. Alright, sweet. The missing shopkeeper. Minecraft wants me to find a book by FD. It has a red cover. John has challenged me with this task. Assignment. One of our undercover agents disappeared a couple of days ago. Your task is to find out what happened to him, and if possible, retrieve the sensitive item he was carrying. Details. The missing agent was last seen leaving his bookshop, which is located in northern Old City at the eastern end of Cito, Quito Street. Description. Angelo Dondolo, a short man of Italian origin, had a stack of books with him and wore a green hat. Distinctive sign. A tattoo of seven stars on his right forearm. Sensitive item. A book by FD. It has a red cover. All right. Sure, why not? Um, okay. So, located in Northern Old City at the eastern end of Cito, or Quito, or Keto, I don't know. At, at the eastern end of that street. Okay. Northern Old City. Ah, there we go. It's not really any... Any super close fast travel points. That's a bummer. But maybe we'll find some. Okay. So we just need to run along here. Y'all, we're getting kind of far in this game. I'm, I'm in, still enjoying it so far. Like a lot, actually. Like even more than I was expecting to. I feel like I'm better at it than I thought I was going to be. Wait, what? Find out where the incredible murder occurred. Okay. Send message. No. After sunset. No. Blinded. Gang war. No. Precise hits. Okay. Rockman dispute. Damn. Okay. That's fine. I'll try it again. Y'all don't see me. With one perfect shot to each eye. Damn. Okay. Gang war was not. Send message was not. Precise hits. Blinded. Rockman Dispute. Stay home. Damn. In Old Ruins. There we go. People are talking about a man who was killed in the Old Ruins on the southwestern side of Grand Saray. Apparently both his eyes were shot out. That strains credulity? Credulity? But it is worth investigating. Alright. Nice. Eyes wide shot. That's so fucked up. Uh, oh, Sherlock, you're so punny. Also, I do want to change my clothes. Back to the sexy ass ensemble. I don't know. Black and red is just that is that is Sherlock's color scheme, for real, for real. Okay, we're coming up along the eastern end of Seto Street, Seto Street, right? So it should be here somewhere.
Ah, books. Found it. It's locked. Mm, bit dusty. Hasn't been touched for a couple of days. Mm, bit dusty. Oh, it's not what I meant to look at. Angelo, I've talked with my boys over at the Smithy, and it's good news. Drop by with your favorite pair, and I will work my magic on them. They will be as good as new in no time. I also had a chat with the physician, and he confirmed my suspicions. Your back problems uh, may be connected to the broken mental inlay in your souls. I recommend you cease to wear them until they have been repaired. Is mail. Hmm. Interesting. All right. Well, we'll continue this investigation in the next episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, share this with your friends, hit the bell so you don't miss an upload, and I'll see you guys next time.